is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring at a combined weight of 460 pounds. Plenty of action coming up as we have six of Ali WWE's top names ready to go here. Oh man, Michael, six man matches like this always remind me of world class back in the 1980s. Making his way to the ring from Japan, weighing in at 238 pounds, Yuri G. Ladies and gentlemen, we have six-man tag team action coming up. And given who's involved in this one, I assure you that you don't want to miss this one. Trust me. And his opponent, first, at a combined weight of 722 pounds, bad. Fuller, Jade O, and the Snake. Six-man tag team matches are always chaotic. Buckle up and get ready, because this one is underway. Looking at the six competitors we have in the ring tonight, I think it's safe to say oh. that we're entering dream match territory right now. This superstar is dangerous both inside and outside the ring. There are instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have not always seen eye to eye or are in the midst of a disagreement. When that's the case, someone on the team must step up and be the voice of reason so the trio can function as a cohesive unit. Earlier you talked about what needs to happen when members of a six-man team have differences or had differences in the past. If the team can't find a way to get on the same page, they will not last very long. Someone on the team has to step up and make sure for at least that match, everyone on the team can work together. That's easier said than done. Just because superstars might be favorites of the WWE Universe or a common enemy, that doesn't mean they'll get along. It also doesn't mean that any past issues will magically go away. In this business, people have long memories, so if someone sees an issue on their team, they need to resolve it right away. Six-man tag team matches have been a staple of competition since the early days of sports entertainment. Two teams have three compete against one another under traditional tag team rules. Stipulations can be added like no disqualification, two out of three falls, elimination, falls count anywhere, or whatever else someone could think of. Matches can also be held in a caged environment. Six-man tags can be fought under so many different types of stipulations. Teams can be part of a faction, where three superstars have aligned because of a common interest. The most crucial aspect to a six-man tag team being successful is that trio's ability to act as one cohesive unit, three individuals working collectively at all times. So much can take place during a six-man tag match. Regardless of what type of match the teams of three are competing in, the members of that team must be on the same page. Oftentimes, the teams who have the best continuity are the most successful. 
Thanks to Raw General Manager Kurt Angle in May of 2017, the WWE Universe saw a dream team. He's looking at it. He's starting to feel it here. I think it's safe to say that the action so far in this six-man tag team match is... Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. Byron, we always make a point to talk about continuity amongst team members. In the six-man match, where Dean Ambrose teamed with the Hardys against Sheamus Cesaro and The Miz, both teams worked very well together. That surprised me, since this was the first time they teamed together. But there was something that night about the Lunas. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, my boy. He's taking some offense. And you know all three of the superstars he's up against won't back down at any point during this match. You know, there's an art to being a successful tag team competitor. And right now, he resembles more of a finger painter. He's got to remember he has two partners ready to enter the fray here. To be successful, the offensive wow. style he's relying on tonight requires he not lose too much stamina. But by the looks of things right now, he might need a new game plan. He's not looking like himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the beginning of the end for him here. Comes in off the tag. Double axe handle smash. You've got to believe this one's over. Ooh. Ooh, nasty impact. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. Oh, he turns it around. six-man tag team match. If they keep bleak right now. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that this beating he's taking is pretty tough to watch. There! That was vicious. His shoulders are down. And he breaks up the pinfall. Let's keep fighting. Fast reflexes. Oh, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Oh my goodness, crushing it. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He's still got plenty of gas left in his tank, though. Nothing to worry about here, Cole. The good news for him is that his opponent's offense is likely packing a little less of a punch, considering all the damage he was able to inflict earlier in this match. Point of the elbow, nailed it. He gets it with a reversal. Two. He's on the defensive here. I think it's safe to say that the action so far in this six-man tag team match is exactly what we expected. Sure, he's taking some punishment oh, here, but given how much he prefers to be on the outside of the ring, he can very well change the outlook of the match with one shot. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment here, right? I mean, it'd be crazy for him to think he was going to walk away from this match completely unscathed. Nailed it. Seven. Oh, destroy your face. He's looking a little weary here. Rather than continuing to absorb any more punishment, he might want to tag out here. Nothing good happens outside the ring. 
which is why I love it when guys go out there. Things are going to heat up now, fellas. It's make or break time here, and he absolutely has to find a way to get back on the offensive if he wants to win this match. He's making a statement here with this attack. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six-man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. 18. 19. And look at the thunderous slam. 20. What a six-man tag match. Here's a few clips from the last match for us. Check this out. He ain't messing around. Check him out here. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. Here are your winners, Bad Fuller, Jade O, and The Snake. And it's a count-out victory here tonight. This is one of those wins you don't forget anytime soon. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest.